welcome back guys to a brand new video and today guys we are playing some more standoff 2 and we're gonna be playing the sniper duel game mode i told you guys i would be revisiting and today guys we are gonna be going no scope only in this game mode now at first i thought it'd be pretty hard but what i noticed is in this game mode you can actually get some pretty accurate no scopes when you're mid in midair unlike your regular no scope that's generally gonna be inaccurate no matter how good your aim is in this specialty game mode when you're in midair i guess they code it in a different way to when you're no scopes they are 100 percent accurate so you can literally if you're good at finding the center of your screen you can literally no scope across the map and it definitely is really fun to do even hit no scope headshots pretty well too and look at that i'm playing on the ipad this screen is definitely a lot bigger so it kind of makes it a lot easier for me to hit no scope. i can actually hit one here come on hit this guy there we go but yeah, hopefully we can do pretty well here. I think on my first video playing this game, I got like 25 kills. So we're going to at least be trying to get a little bit more than 25 kills here. I don't know how I'm missing this guy. Can I please? Oh, my teammate just knifed him. I, I, honestly, they need to get rid of knife in this game. But I know I kind of complained, with, especially about knifing. But like knifing should not have been this game. And it actually still gives you points and everything too. Because some players just, just run around the map knifing. This guy is just sitting here. I don't know what he's doing. We can get this guy way across here. I'm trying to see if I can how accurate this thing can be. If I can just line it up. It's really hard to line up because, again, you still are no scoping. So it still is pretty hard to line up. I'm missing this one. Come on. Come on, please. Oh, I actually got a headshot there. There we go. Get after the look. Let me back off here. The reloading does take forever, though. I can't lie. Oh, my gosh. Not this guy. Come on. I was worried he was going to knife. I think we're just trying to run to the corner for safety. There we go. Can get this one. No, we're missing that. There we go. But as you can see, at certain ranges, you can still get crazy accurate no scopes. This guy right here. It just It's just dead accurate, which is insane. It definitely makes it kind of fun, really just challenging yourself to see how well you can actually no scope when you're going to be 100% accurate with each shot, which definitely makes it fun. But yeah, we're not doing too bad. We're already at 10 kills. If we keep going, we could probably get up to 50 kills if we just stop missing shots. Come on. This guy's right on me. There we go. But I do notice a lot of people actually do no scope versus going for quick scope. But I can't tell which one's easier. Honestly, quick scope does not feel that bad at all. But I think at certain points, like at long range, where you're missing all those shots, it just makes a lot more sense to maybe go for the quick scope there. If you do know how to use the M40, probably that guy tried to knife me though. Look, I hit him with the quick scope. Well, not quick scope. I mean a no scope. I'm so used to going for quick scopes here. Okay, we have to reload again. But this game mode is definitely fun. There's like so many different play styles you can do from. Sadly, people who knife, I don't want to talk about them. But knifing, of course, no scope, quick scope, whichever one just fits you best. Come on. There we go. Hit him twice. Yeah, I love it like when you're able to hit both shots in mid. It's a, it's, a, it's a better just satisfaction there. There we go. It's another guy, right? Come on. Oh, man, it's so hard to hit them long range ones. Almost had that one. You can see like just the bullet holes like super close because it's 100% accurate. It's crazy. But I'm glad to do that. It definitely just makes it more fun. I mean, your chance of just hitting the M40 no scope is already almost impossible in the first place. So I'm kind of glad they definitely made it just like a 100% accurate thing. This guy's trying to knife me. Come on, dude. You have a gun. Can I please? Oh, he's, gonna, he's still going for me. Oh, he's going to get it. Oh, my gosh. He almost had me there. I don't know how I missed that shot. Good. My teammate saved me there. I think he did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, but a lot of these guys just sitting here going for knife kills. Get this one right here. Yeah, it's still it's still just hard to like center up the screen, but the fact that you can and still hit crazy no scopes to me is just, just super crazy. We're already halfway through at 17 kills. We're definitely gonna break past 25. Can we go for 50? If you can get 50 kills, I think that would be insane. But let me know the method you got. Here a lot of people do let me know. Do you actually try to go for no scopes a lot of times in close range? When I'm normal playing, for the most part, I'm just sitting there hitting no scopes. But then at any long range kill, I'll definitely try to go for um a quick scope there because I'm just a higher chance of me hitting the shot. Like right here. I'm going to keep missing. Can I line it up? Oh, man, I missed. Yeah, it's definitely hard to hit those shots. This guy's just AFK. There we go. Yeah, I feel sad for their team. The score is 44 to 17. This is basically spawn trapping at this point. Not basically. It legit is spawn trapping. They can barely get a spawn without us hitting them with the M40. They got one teammate AFK here. Can we, can we hit it, please? Oh, my gosh. I keep missing. Yeah, there's no way I'm hitting that. What the heck is that sound? Did you guys hear that? I don't know what the heck. What is that weird sound? I don't know how they're doing that. Like, is it? Are they switching guns? It's a really weird sound. I'm not sure. Maybe it was the game. This guy, he, he's doing. How is he doing that? It's like this weird winding sound. I'm not sure. 
But this game mode is so quiet. You definitely do hear a lot of things you normally don't hear. You always just hear just tiny, just snipers because you know, all the weapons are silent. So pretty much everything's quiet. No like crazy, just loud gunfights going on. But that's just a weird sound. I don't know what that is. So this guy up here. There we go. I'm like, we haven't hit a no scope in a while. Come on, second one. Oh, we missed it. This guy too, yeah. You definitely go for those double shots there. You try to hit them all in mid. The second you hit the ground, your shot's gonna be inaccurate again. It only works when you're in, um, just in the air. It's 100% accurate. So if I go down here, look at my center screen right there. Look what the shots. Oh, okay, this guy killed. I'm trying to show something, but let me go right here. In my spawn, we're But as you can see, if I'm right here and I shoot, the bullets go everywhere. But if I look right here and go mid, you can see it lands directly where my aim is at. Which is definitely really cool. So yeah, it's all about being in midair. If you're gonna be on the ground, you definitely wanna go for a quick scope because it's just a lot easier. But midair is definitely way to go. And plus, the midair kills give you more points anyway, which helps you out with the pass. If I could, come on. Oh man, that's why right. close range can be hard sometimes. Maybe mainly when they're like right below you, you know, you can't look directly below you. So they kind of like move around like this to try to get them. You can't just like look down and hit them. Is there a guy in the building? See, where is he? Is there, there's, the main map is saying there's a person right here. Oh, he's up. He's on the top. There we go. Got the headshot too. Come on. This is so weird playing this. I mean, it's one thing to go no scope only. I've done that before. But going no scope only when you're like flying, it's just like it just it just adds upon the weirdness and the complicatedness of the game. But we're already at 25 kills here. Again, I want to try to hit 50 now. I don't know, man. We only got three minutes. We were missing shots like crazy now. Yeah, once you're like moving up and down, just adding elevation to the mix, it definitely makes it harder. There we go. Guy's gonna kill us. No, my teammate knifed him. Come on, man. He's taking all my kills by knifing. Like, stop. The thing is, like, the knife is like 99 damage, but because I'm, I'm shooting each one before he gets the kill, it just makes it a lot easier. I'm just getting constant assist. Yeah, I think, did we get a single? You got one kill in that whole entire gun. I think I shot like 10 shots or something. Crazy like that. Come on. There we go. Yeah, you can get a long range one. They're definitely harder, but you can still get them. Can, can you not? You have a gun, man. He's definitely gonna come in. Oh, we got it. This guy right here, too. Just so weird playing like this. It definitely is. But I, I really want you guys to try it on just see what it's like and just see how easy it is. And the crazy um no scopes you can actually hit that you normally wouldn't be able to hit in a regular game. But it just simply wouldn't be that accurate. Come on. Can, can you? Oh man, he finally knifed me. I actually had that shot almost lined up there. Can I? I tried. I tried, man. I, I can just run up to my nose scope. I don't know why I'm trying to sit there and do that. I can just simply, if I get close enough, my regular nose scope is going to be accurate. If I just go like this, we're going to see if we can find somebody. You can stop moving. It's still super inaccurate. Yeah, no scoping is just so inaccurate. I actually hit that last shot there. You gotta go for the regular way, yeah. Just sitting there trying to hit regular no scope, you're just not gonna be as accurate. Well, I did that no scope video I did in defeat, so it's just pretty much me camping and just holding corners kind of perfectly where I know I have a good chance of hitting the shot. Oh, there we go. Got a nice headshot there. Oh my gosh, we only have a minute left. I don't think we're getting anywhere close. We're only at 30 kills. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna be getting 20 kills in just a minute and 30. Especially with the way these guys are spawning. Like, half of them are AFK. Come on, it's just not happening. Yeah, these guys are, they actually, that Chinese guy is actually pretty good. He's hitting some crazy shots. Try to move around here this way. Yeah, they seem to just be all just hard scoping that way. Oh my gosh, this guy is insane with it. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna go for the close range no scope out. We're gonna try what happens when we're not jumping here. So he's not really paying attention. Just looking up at people. That's what, no, since everybody's in the air, he's just sitting there looking up. There we go. Really with the knife, man, you have a gun. Stop trying to go for knife kills. We still need to get 15 kills. Yeah, the chance of this happen is just, just just zero to none. We're gonna at least probably get 40, hopefully. If I could come on. Yeah, when you're below you, it's almost impossible to hit the shot. There we go. Kind of hit it with the no scope flick there. I wonder, is your no scope accurate when you're like moving sideways? Like, I know when you're moving up and down, it's 100% accurate. But I feel like when I move sideways sometimes, it just doesn't feel as accurate. Or maybe just it's just me moving more. Oh, I thought the guy running across me hit me. I'm like, how the heck did that happen? We just got 17 seconds. And I don't think 40 kills is going to be possible. Just took that guy out. Come on. Oh, we just got taken out. 
But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this going no scope only with the M40. It was definitely something interesting, especially to do it in this crazy, like, flying sniper game mode. But leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and if you really care, don't hit the like button. Peace, guys.